Hey there guys, Skippy here from Skippy6Gaming coming to you from tutorial world number two or three, but today what we're going to do is look at one of the most ludicrous displays of bone meal waste in the history of the game. However, super handy. If you have a mob grinder like me, I mean, I even end up throwing out some bone meal uh, because you can only farm so much stuff, even in auto farms, that, you know, the bone meal is just excessive. So, if you have too much bone meal and you want to get rid of it, this is going to be how you do it. I must say that this whole build started when I was I was watching a video by Nims Toots on PC uh, on how to make one of these things. And he made one of these things like this and I was like, okay, cool, that works. It was like a dye factory or something, but I kind of took it a little over the top and kind of went a little buck wild and, and extended it to four units and uh, in addition set up like a mine cart with hopper because it drops it drops so fast that you can't you need to be able to pick it up so many drops will fall right on the dirt this took a little while but this thing i'm telling you right now over 1000 drops over 1000 drops in a minute so that minute will pretty much empty all of these dispensers i'm not even going to waste your time anymore i'm just going to turn it on uh, it's ludicrous there i don't even know what's going on but as you can see it's crazy they're flying everywhere. This hopper minecart down here is getting it. I've literally just tested this one or two times and it's just buck wild. It's non-stop. Pretty much, as you can see right here, these are all here, but these hoppers are pretty much full. Like, that one there, not so much. This one here, you can see they're just loading up, loading up, loading up. All of them. There's 14 hoppers down there that can't even handle the load. Uh, we've only been going for not even a half a minute. It is just plain insane. So I don't see it's glitching out even. It's like these things are going to stop at about a minute. Uh, there's nine stacks times two, 18 stacks of bone meal per each one. And you're going to be using uh, the lilacs, peonies, sunflowers, and rose bushes, uh, if you ask me. They're really good. Like like I said, guys, this might not be necessary for your world, but believe me, you're never going to need die ever again if you build this. So let's jump into this build. I'm going to turn this off. You can tell it's so much drops that even the hopper takes a while to pick these up. You'll see. Uh, they will actually continue to go into this chest for ages. I think I blocked off the chest here. No, it's going. It just takes forever, guys. It's literally... This, they will get picked up before they despawn, uh, but if you want to have this much dye, so whatever it is, let's go, let's make this build. So, uh, sunflower, lilac, rosebush, peonies are going to be the flowers of choice. There's four, four item frames. Uh, we're going to need, let's see, I'm going to get my stuff. Uh, 21 glass, one door, four dirt, eight dispensers, one lever, two chests, one comparator, nine dust, six blocks of choice, 19 half slabs, two powered rails, eight hoppers I'm lying 14 hoppers and uh, there's gonna be about six or seven regular rails in there as well so uh, let's go these guys I'm telling you will get picked up eventually before the five minutes is up uh, I feel like this chest is locked in some way but let's not mess with that it works believe me they're just loading up uh, and let's get into this build so first things first you're gonna I totally I totally left uh, all the items from my last tutorial in my bar. That's horrible. Uh, dispensers, redstone dust. We're going to need a comparator, repeater. Let's go. So pretty much, guys, first things first, what you're going to do is go ahead and figure out where your dirt's going to be. Uh, you could make this even bigger, but let's just skip one, skip one, skip one. So we'll grab our dispensers and we'll go in front of this guy. Jump in your crouch, please right there and let's just do that on all four dirts it's just crazy I don't, I don't think I've ever found an actual item in Minecraft that creates so many drops uh, they will for the whole five minutes they'll just be getting picked up um, okay so let's start this build right here basically guys it's a pretty straightforward one grab yourself your block of choice and uh, let's put one up on the back side of this guy and then we're going to bring it down by one right here and then right here is going to be your lever perfect looks good grab yourself a comparator your comparator is going to come out uh, the comparator is oh look I messed up put this block right here now grab a redstone dust the redstone dust goes here comparator goes here once the comparator goes up here bring the dust here here and here and now you're cooking with gas take this guy down here and here 
and then what we're going to do is start bringing it over put a block of choice behind all of these guys with a redstone repeater in between each one of them like this right here and then we are going to put a redstone dust here 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 perfect so hopefully let's just make sure this guy works by throwing a lever if it works that is pretty much i guess if you had to say there was a difficult part of this oh so don't forget to put this guy on subtract actually one of the few builds in my life that i've actually used that on subtract and there you go <laughs> absurd amount of bone meal use coming right up okay so now that we've done that most of the hard work is out of the way however it is not so let's just clear out uh a three spot in front of it right down to the end so now what we're going to do is go under because when I first did this build guys as you can see there is no drops left now they've all got used um, the first problem was the amount of drops and when you put a hopper in between is actually so many drops land right on this dirt uh, that you actually is super inefficient um, and if you're going to use all this uh, bone meal then the point is to use it so basically what I did was I generated a I wanted to get a minecart with hopper here because a minecart with hopper can take the blocks through a full block of dirt uh, so I wanted to get one of those involved in the in the mix and we'll just put dirt there and we're down here so pretty much what I do from this point in time is I grab myself let's grab our rails let's grab regular rails let's grab hoppers let's grab a torch and let's start this so first things first what I did was I'm going to put a torch in here put a torch in here that's good I'm gonna grab my block of choice put it here and put it here both of these guys are gonna get a powered rail after the fact and then what we're going to do here is we're going to want a, a line of hoppers going on the front to this chest right here. So we'll grab the chest right now. We're just going to put down one for the moment because that's all we really need at the time. So grab this guy, grab your hoppers and start bringing hopper down. So, But while you're doing it, guys, go ahead and put a hopper into this guy as well. Hopper down. Again, it doesn't as technically matter, but I like to put one in there one in there one in there you see what I'm doing here this one here is the hard one <laughs> I'm gonna end up busting this dirt that's fine so now what I'm gonna do is just crouch down and make sure that we put this guy into this guy perfect grab some dirt put our dirt back okay so now that that's done let's grab our regular rails jump in the air regular rails all the way across minecart with hopper the key to success for this build if you ever want to have millions of die I think I'm pretty sure this is this and let's just knock it and it'll go and there you go that thing's going back and forth this thing's shooting off um, and then you could cover it with whatever you want I think what we'll do is uh, grab some half slabs and some glass blocks and your build is pretty much done here guys I'm not gonna go and fill uh, every single one every single one of these you guys seen how it works let's go grab uh, let's go grab our flizz hours what's going on that's what's going on so it's these guys right here uh, lilac rosebush sunflower Lilac, Rosebush, Sunflower, and Peonies right here. And there you go. We're going to throw the Peonies here, Sunflower here, Rosebush. Good to go. Grab yourself uh, blocks of choice and bury this bad boy. This is where your chest is, so you can just make some quick little stairs going up and down there. What I did in the front here was I made sure that I blocked in each one of these. These ones here, I did all the way. Um, I found that it was actually pretty handy to have uh, a door going in. So I definitely threw a door right on the front here. And then what I did was also I half slabbed it. You got to make sure you half slab stuff. So if you build in survival, 
this guy here. Let's just bring him across. Looks good to me. Make sure you put a block right here as well, guys. Uh, keep it sealed up. It's These things fly pretty good. Uh, and then I do that in the front. Again, you can put your item frames right here. Actually, is we'll just... We'll just do it this way. How about this? A new style. Right there, right there, right there. And then uh, let's grab a Dizor. Grab item frames. And there you go. Pretty much I threw the door on here inside like this. And throw the item frames on top of each of the flowers like this. And there you go, guys. It's pretty much it. As you can see, it is, lu it is ludicrously fast. I bet you this one here is still unloading. Uh, is still unloading flowers in these hoppers. Look, look, it's, it's crazy. They haven't stopped. I feel like I might have... <laughs> I think the chest is full on the next ones. Look at that, on those ones right there. Holy cow. It is. Ludicrous, watch. And there we go. Grab it, grab it, grab it. <laughs> it's literally, I don't know, I, would, I was going to do this and be like, how many drops an hour? I'm telling you, it's like 50, 60,000 drops an hour. Uh... The one thing that says that you won't be able to do that is that these dispensers being full, uh, if you can see, they were totally full when I started, and uh, as you can see how much is left now. We went through about half, so it could probably run for about two minutes, giving you about 2,000 drops. Uh, that said, it's super cool. So don't forget to smash that like, and uh, don't forget to make huge turbo die factories, because, uh, hey, you know, everybody needs an infinity amount of sunflowers, you know, just in case, but... Smash the like, subscribe. Thanks, and I'll catch you on the next one.